Greetings and welcome to the Astronomy Picture of the Day podcast. Today's picture for February 15th of 2024 is titled NGC 253, Dusty Island Universe. So what do we see here? Well, this is an example of a spiral galaxy, sometimes called an island universe, for looking off into space and seeing something like our own Milky Way off in the distance. And you have to consider that at one point our Milky Way was thought to be the entire universe, just as even longer before that our entire solar system was the entire universe. So it's kind of a throwback to those times. Now this is a relatively nearby galaxy only 10 million light years away. And while that may seem like a tremendous distance to us, 10 million light years on the scale of galaxies is in our own backyard. The nearest spiral galaxy and large galaxy is the Andromeda galaxy about two and a half million light years away. And we see far more galaxies that are hundreds of millions or even billions of light years away. Now when we look at a spiral galaxy we see certain things that make it very prominent. Spiral galaxies are known for undergoing star formation. So we see the results of that here. And we see starting with the dusty areas as it is a dusty island universe, those dark splotches within the disk of the galaxy are actually the presence of excess material. We don't see the excess gas very easily because it's invisible, it's clear. But we can see the dust which blocks out the light from behind it. Now we also see the blue light of stars and those are the hot star clusters that have formed. Now when stars clusters form the first stars to form are the very largest ones they form faster and they are also bigger and brighter than the later stars that will form. So when star formation is going on those are the stars we see most and those very hot very massive stars give off a lot of blue light and you can see the distinct blue color associated with the spiral arms here. We also see a few pink regions and those are hydrogen gas. Now in general hydrogen gas and many other gases are clear you can't see them directly just like looking through our atmosphere you don't see the gases. However when gases are excited such as in a tube of gas here on earth and you put an electrical current through it that can excite the atoms and cause them to glow. Well, something like that happens in the galaxies. These uh, clusters are close to very hot stars, which emit not only the blue light that we see, but also a lot of ultraviolet radiation, which can excite the hydrogen gas and cause it to glow, giving off that distinct pink color. Now as we work down toward the center we can see the color kind of changes. There are a lot of older stars in the center and you get a mix of those hot blue stars and the very uh, cool red giant stars and red super giant stars that dominate the older portions of the central of the parts of the galaxy and you can see a distinct color change as you move into the inner parts. And of course at the center of the galaxy is a supermassive black hole that is near that would be located near the center. Now this galaxy emits a lot of high energy light and high energy light are things like x-rays and gamma rays. So extremely high energy compared to the ordinary visible light that we're used to looking at. And that is a sign of the intense gravity of a supermassive black hole at the center of this and most galaxies that we look at. So that was our picture of the day for February 15th of 2024. It was titled NGC 253 Dusty Island Universe. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture previewed to be Volcano World. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.